Hi boys and girls, here's your next project. You're going to work on hatching and cross hatching. Now if you don't remember what that is, hatching means that you're coloring in one direction. Cross hatching means that you are coloring in the opposite direction. Okay, I like to also think of this as the Japanese word enzo. It means that each motion, each thing that you do has purpose. It's not like you're going in here and you're going to scribble. It means that you're doing something with meaning, okay? First job, put your name on your paper. Okay, whenever I color, I turn my paper to the side. Now you can do this in any pattern you want or it doesn't even have to be a pattern. I just picked a variety of colored pencils. So let's start with, I'm going to start out with a teal looking color. I want you to hatch and cross hatch in each of these sections. Now this makes everything look very smooth. In fact, I'll bring this up. Do you see how smooth that looks? I can still see some area, so I can always go back and, and uh, color in a diagonal. Okay, once you get done with this, and if you notice, I use two different colors here. I use complementary colors, my orange and blue. But once you get done with this, we're going to move on to the gradient. This just means you go from light to dark. Watch me first. Okay, I'm gonna start here and work my way this way.
Okay, boys and girls. Now you'll have to finish this out. You could even do this up here and those two sections down here. But this is my example of your colored pencils and how they work. You have a great day.